Smita. I am studying in 4th standard at Velamal Vidyalaya Karambakar. Today I am going to narrate a story. The title of the story is Grandpa Storm Chappal. Let's meet the characters. It's Grandpa. Share our pet dog and a cobbler. Let's begin the story. Once upon a time, in a small village, there was a grandpa in his small field. He wore glasses. He walks with a cane. One day, when he, when he was working on his field, suddenly he heard a crying sound of a dog like this. He came to the puppy, to puppy. Then he, then he saw here and there, but no, nobody was there to help this poor puppy. So Grandpa took, took this puppy. After he took this puppy to his house, he named this puppy as Sheru. After, after naming Sheru, Grandpa. Grandpa poured some water on on its blood and covered with clean bandage. After three days, the puppy was recovered and they, and soon they became best friends. After a year, Sheru grew into a dog. One day, Grandpa forgot to wear his glasses and he tripped over a stone. And Sheru heard Grandpa's noise. Get my chapel! Then Sheru, Sheru rushed to grab Grandpa's chapel. But one of Grandpa's chapel was stored. Sheru, then Sheru thought, I don't want to give this torn chapel to my ma Grandpa. Then Sheru grabbed those. Then Sheru grabbed the chapel which has stored and rushed to a cobbler's house by sniffing. Then, then he barked at the door. Oh, 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 oh. Then cobbler, then the cobbler opened the door and he saw a dog holding a chapel, a torn chapel. Huh, a dog with a chapel on his hand? Okay. Your master must be poor. I'll I'll mend the chap I'll mend the chapel for you. Then after 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 a minute the cobbler mended the chapel and gave it to Sheru. Then Sheru grabbed the chapel and happily ran to his grandpa. Then he gave then grandpa asked why did it took took so long to get my chapel, Sheru? Then Sheru grabbed Grandpa's cane to the cobbler's house. Then the then the cobbler saw, Sir, is this your dog? Yes. What happened? Then the cobbler explained everything to Grandpa. And. And Grandpa gave the money to the cobbler. And when Sheru and Grandpa went to went to Grandpa's house, Grandpa gave a big hug to Sheru. Oh, my wise Sheru, you're such a good dog. The moral of the story is, if we help others when when they're in trouble. They will help us in return if we are in danger. Thank you.